Hi, in this video, we're going to take a look at how you can create a contact detail on the Samsung Galaxy S21 series. Now first, let's go back to your home screen by tapping on the home key at the bottom of the screen. And then on the home screen, swipe up to go into app screen. In here, tap on contacts. So you may need to swipe across to find the contacts app. Tap on it. And next, to create a new contact, you tap on the add button at the top here. And in here, you can give your contact a name. So for example, I'm just going to say something like that. ID jungles 2 and then phone number, you can print the phone number. You can add in multiple phone numbers. So if that person got a mobile number, home phone number, you can add in a work number. Next, you go down to email. In the email text field, you can put in the email. Test at gmail.com. Now, if they have multiple emails, you can tap on the add button to add more emails, or you can just tap on the remove button to remove them. And next is a group. You can add it to the group. Now, this is optional. By default, it is set to not assign group. You can choose uh, other group such as coworkers, family, friends. So you have you can they can a contact can be in multiple group. So it can be more than one group. It can be coworkers, it can be friends, and it can be other group as well. Now, if there is a group that is not in here, they, then you can tap on create group. Create group allow you to create a new group. So uh, let's say we're going to create a group called test two. And here we have selected that this contact, uh, which group it belongs to. And then now I'm going to tap on the back key. And next, you can tap on view more. This will expand out some further text field, allowing you to fill in more information such as work info. So job title, I don't know. So app developer. And then department, app support, for example, and company. And then address, you can choose an address if you wanted to. Important date, uh, important date can be like birthday, so you can choose a date. And then tap on done. So you can add in multiple important date. So you can add in another one. You got an anniversary date. You can choose other date as well. If there is no other date, you can you can just remove it. Now you can choose a relationships for this contact. So you just tap on that, and then you can type it in, such as parents or child, or whatever it is that you want to add in. If there's nothing, you can leave it blank. Now all of these are optionals. Uh, you do not need to fill them in, but you can if you wanted to. Website, you know, you got messengers account. So for example, you got WhatsApp. You can tap on that to choose a different uh, messenger service. If the, the one that you are using or the one that they are using is not in the list, you can create a custom type. And let's say for WhatsApp, we can put in the name, IT Jungles. Uh, for example, and then ringtone, you can assign a custom or a specific ringtone for this contact. Now, all the new contact will be assigned with a default ringtone. However, if you want to set a customized ringtone for that contact, so that whenever they call you, you will immediately recognize who's calling by listening to the sound of the ringtone. So here we have assigned a unique ringtone for that contact and then you got the last option is the vibration pattern so you can choose a vibration for that contact and finally uh, before you tap on the save button let's go back to the top there's one thing that we have uh, forgot to do is to assign a picture if you do have a picture for that contact you can assign them you can use a camera so if your contact is right next to you you can tap on the camera and capture the, a photo of them or you can tap on gallery. There is also some preset uh, image that you can choose uh, in here. 
or you can uh, simply uh, use the gallery so if you tap on gallery you can choose a photo from gallery in here you can readjust the image and you can also move this um, adjustment around you can also resize the image by tracking on the handle not the image but the selection tool so this is basically you select where on the image you want to to select and then tap on done and then tap on saved and that's it so you can see now we have successfully create a contact detail on the galaxy s21 and we have populated most of the information about this contact in here so if you tap on the home key to go back to your home screen and if you open up the font application you can tap on contacts over here and in contacts you can uh, go down the list and you can check it out so you can see contacts id jingles 2 it has that image there you can tap on information to open up the contact and that's it now there is another way how you can easily create a contact so let's say if someone gives you a call you can tap on the font application then tap on recent in recent tabs let's say this contact here give you a call you can tap on that and then there is a shortcut right there where you can tap on add to contacts now on the pop-up it will give you an option to create a new contact or update an existing contact so let's say if you want to create a new contact you tap on that and the phone number will be placed in the mobile section and in here all you have to do is just populate other text, text field such as the name the photo phone number email and so on and that's it so there are different ways how you can uh, create contacts so you can see here in the phone application you can also tap on the contacts tab at the bottom and at the top you can tap on the add button to create a new contact as well and that's it finally you can tap on the home button to go back to your home screen thank you for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more videos